about y'all. So I was going to vlog my day today. Um, I just woke up and I'm literally, I'm so embarrassed at myself because it is 1130. I can't tell you the last time I slept past 11 or even 10 for that matter. I just like, I guess my body just like must have needed it. Like I had a cycle bar class at 1130, missed that. Um, yeah, so this Monday is starting off way slower and I'm like, Quite honestly, I'm a little horrified at myself. I'm like, why did I sleep until 11.30 in the morning? So yeah, I'm just gonna, I'm not gonna let it ruin my week though. I'm just taking it as my body needed it. Obviously my body was listening to my body and you know, there was some reason that I wasn't supposed to be out today. So whatever, we're starting a little later <laughs> than anticipated. Um, So today, uh, obviously I was gonna do a cycle class. Um, I have to pack up some Poshmark orders and I have to shoot some content for Tula um and then I guess now I'm just gonna do a home workout because I miss cycle bar so yeah let's get rolling so I like to include these little thank you notes in my Poshmark packages just because I feel like it adds more personal touch. I'm thinking about getting like custom cards or something so I don't have to like write them out every time, but just something I do. All right, so I'm going to go run these in. I put on, you know, my formal going outside outfit. Also, y'all, it's so warm outside today. It's like 70 degrees. Oh yeah, this is my, you know, I just got some leggings on and a nice cheetah crop <clears throat> situation going on. But yeah, it's like so warm outside today. It's really weird. It's weirding me out. It's like seven it says it's 71 degrees outside. So I actually forgot that I needed some fake eyelashes. So I'm going into Walgreens right now. Just like the little like lash insert inserts. I'll show you guys. These make your lashes look like you have fake ones on, but like they look really, really real. They look like not like lash extensions kind of. So get some of those. Just some Friday Good night place. lights while I do my makeup. Knees over here, man. Rewatching it again. So I just wanted to show y'all um, the lashes, like when they're on, cause they're really like, they look like real. Like you can't tell, like there's no strip, but I'm obsessed with them. Um, if you haven't tried them, they take a little bit of like practice to get used to putting them on. But like once you're used to it, it's totally fine. So this is, um, I'm going for like a like a clean look today, um, just because it is Tula, it's like a skincare line. So yeah, this is, I'm gonna go shoot the Tula content, um, it's like, looks like it's gonna rain. It's like getting really dark, so that's what I'm doing. Okay, so I just finished shooting. This is like my little shoot corner in this house because this house is, we have like a, like it's really, really cute. It's, um, it was like totally gutted. Um, it's in like a really cute little part of Memphis, um, but it's small, it's, so this is like my little corner that I like shooting all the time. Liz actually did those drawings for me. I'm so excited about those. Um, but yeah, this is where I do all my content just because it's like I can set up my ring light right here and it's really white and bright and clean. Um, but I actually like, I just did an ad for these, but, and like I'm not being paid to talk about them on this channel, but like these are really, really awesome. Like my skin has gotten so much better since I started using these. Um, so if you don't use toner, I would try these because no joke like my pores and like just like my skin texture has gotten so much better it's like crazy I'm like a bad skincare person to talk because I never used toner before so but now I do <laughs> all right so I just sent all my content over um for approval and now I have to clean waffle look at like look at all the stuff on these surfaces like I don't know if like people like that doesn't bother people, but for me, like surfaces just like need to be clean. I don't know why. That's like one of my clean things. Um, so yeah, so I'm gonna do right now. So I just talked to Liz for like an hour on the phone. It's like literally, we always joke, we just like call each other just to like talk about nothing essentially. <laughs> um, so now I am doing the lovely chore of sweeping the floor. That rhymed. <laughs> this is the stuff they don't tell you about having a hardwood floor. Like, I feel like I'm sweeping my floor 
every single day because it's like grass and like God knows what else. All right, taking a break from cleaning because I just got some packages. Um, this one, these are the cross, the airy crossover leggings that I have been dying to try. They finally came back in stock. And this is from my friend Lacey Cavalier. She has a new company called Go Genreless, and it's like a crew neck sweatshirt. So I'm going to open these. Oh my God, it's so cute. Okay. Do these look infant size to you? Like, what? <sighs> okay. So it turns out they're really stretchy, which is good because I, mm, I guess that's how my Lulus were too. The first time I tried, ex or uh, like a two, I was like, oh my God, these look infant size. They're really stretchy. I love them though. They're so cute. This is my new uniform. <laughs> No, really, though. It's like a really oversized crew neck. Got my new leggings on. This is like, Wit always jokes, like, this is literally what I live in, like, all the time. Just like an oversized crew neck and leggings or sweatpants. So, y'all, I'm like freaking out right now because um, one of the cycle bar instructors just DM me and said that, oh my God, my washer is so loud. Um, DM me and said that they had to cancel the 1130 class anyway because the power was out. I have like, like literally like chills like all over my body. Like what is happening? That's like too weird. That is like such a weird coincidence. Hello Waffle. <laughs> Look a boy. You need a haircut. Beep boop. So now Memphis is under a severe thunderstorm warning which I absolutely love thunderstorms, if you didn't know. Um, I can hear it, but I can't see it yet. It's coming from like a weird part. Like I'm such a nerd. Like it's coming from a weird part of the sky. <laughs> it's coming from the Southwest, which doesn't usually happen. So this is gonna be fun. This on Twitter uh, as well. And we'll have that information passed along to us here at uh, News Channel 3. 1-800-76-NEWS-3 is the phone number that you can call to report. that storm was unimpressive it literally just rained so got my hopes up for nothing a couple good thunders I guess I <sighs> one thing I really wish that our kitchen had actually is a pantry because literally our pantry is like this and oh my god that's so embarrassing it like I need to go through it so bad but we're thinking about replacing this like little drawer thing we have here and like putting in a pantry there just because that's really like the, there's not a lot of storage in this kitchen which we miss a lot so but for now my pantry is on the counter <laughs> all right so i finally finished tidying up for the most part it's looking pretty good just you know a couple things like laundry over there i gotta finish etc um i did a workout i did a i do the sweat app um I'm doing the new Stephanie Sanzo workouts right now because they're a lot of muscle stuff uh, for my wedding. And I do cycle bar for cardio. So this is kind of like a nice balance. Um, but yeah, I just did that. It was full body today. It was a lot of um, random stuff. I'm gonna feel it tomorrow, I can tell you that. Um, but yeah, so now I'm going to figure out what to make for dinner. Wit came home for a second. Um, he is hitting golf balls at the moment. He, um, if you have like a boyfriend or a husband, Wit has the golf bug right now. I kid you not. He's like obsessed with golfing. <laughs> so yeah, that's uh, what I've got planned for the rest of the night. I think we're going to start a new TV show, but we'll see. All right. So got my wine. Cheers. Uh, tonight I'm making wings. I'm in like a really big wing phase because I think they're so good and they're easy to make 
Usually I make them in my air fryer, but I think I'm going to bake mine tonight just because man, actually might add some of those too. Uh, just because I have so many and this air fryer, I can only do about half of them. Uh, so I think I'm gonna bake them tonight, but I'm gonna show you guys what I put in them because it's so easy and so good. Beautiful waffle. When he goes poop, I go, <gasps> did you go poop? <gasps> did you go poop? Did you go poop? <laughs> Come on, let's get your treat. Yeah. I don't know if any of y'all have dogs that also love these, but man, Waffle literally sits by the bar where they sit because he loves them so much. He sit, bark, a full bark, full bark, good boy. <laughs> okay, so all you need for these wings is salt, which we've got the big salt because we like salt in this house again. Garlic powder, same. Need the big garlic powder. Um, I like to use white pepper for these just because I think it's like a softer pepper taste, if that makes sense. And um, paprika, this is like a fancy paprika, but you can use like whatever paprika you want. Um, so basically, I don't really use measurements. I just kind of like eyeball it based on like the amount of wings. And then um, I like smell it when it's all mixed up and decide if I need more or not. So that was garlic powder. I do, I, I will say, I do more garlic powder and paprika. I don't do as much pepper. So like, that's that's like all the pepper I'm gonna do, not that much. Um, paprika, let's just eyeball it here. That much. Now the salt. You can always add more salt is my motto. So that's probably good. It's better to add more salt than have to uh, eat something salty. So now I'm just gonna like take some tongs. Oh my God, it smells so good. And just like mix it all up. <laughs> God, this actually looks disgusting, like plain wings. <laughs> So this is, this is a good ratio, I can tell, because it smells really good. So now I just like, I like to let it sit for a little bit. Um, obviously not too long because it's raw meat, um, but about 10 minutes, just wait for the oven to preheat. Okay, so now I'm gonna let these sit for a little bit. I'm gonna go preheat the oven to 400. So I like to have two bowls because um, at the 15 minute mark, I'm gonna take out the wings and actually toss them in butter for that extra crispy when I'm baking. Okay, so got them all lined up. I'm gonna throw them in the oven. Okay, so wings are out. So what I'm gonna do is get a different pair of tongs because um, I was raised by a germaphobic mother. And I'm going to put that in the bowl. Okay, so again, this is something I like to eyeball, but I usually do about a half a stick of butter. God, it's home. <gasps> oh. Okay, so now I just literally just pour it all in. And then I just do the same thing. Toss it up. And then I'm just gonna put it back on the baking sheet for another 15 minutes and the wings will be done. So yeah. these are the final wings. I like to dip them in, yep. <laughs> I like to dip them in Frank's Red Hot and Ranch personally, but Wit likes them plain. They're really good. Don't you think, Whit? Yeah. Yeah, go on the bed. Waffle. Thank you. <laughs> Thank y'all for watching. Um, this is just like a... Actually, I feel like a lot more <laughs> interesting things happened today. 
than usual with like a storm and just my cycle bar story but um thank y'all for tuning in